nos réalisateurs sont très bons, nos artistes sont très bons. Tout ce qui se passe de ce côté, côté culturel, change tellement vite et dans une très, gros, une très grande dynamique. Donc du coup, je pense que très bientôt, toute l'Afrique centrale et l'Afrique entière va prendre exemple. Sur. Better get it hot, bomb proof for explosion. No, no way to be indifferent. You must have get bruised. How can I fall off when I'm stuck in the boot? When growing up, when coming up, we had like very, very, very little hope because we thought the music here cannot compete with what is out there. We keep on insisting, we keep on pushing our music. They started believing in us. They started thinking that we also have something great in Cameroon, good enough to compete with what we consume from the foreign countries. I've always, always fought to stay true to what I believe in. As long as I'm not standing on one spot and I'm walking, no matter how slow, I'm moving towards that place. Believe in yourself and keep pushing. Cameroon is a country full of talent. There are so many like, different genres that you can find here. And uh, with the proper organization, things will go faster. But people are not like necessarily waiting for major labels, you know. They go on with the thing and things are moving. I've had like a couple of labels try to sign me before now. And the reason why it didn't work out is because they always want to make me do what I don't want to do, what I'm going to do. It's exactly what I want to do. All you can do is help me do this thing I want to do and make me do it better. I'm not going to divert to something else just because you say it's best for the season or for whatever. Nobody can believe in your dream more than you can. You don't wait on them to live their own dreams to come and realize yours. So you have to go there, fight for it. Go get it. Believe it. Make it a reality. I'm um, hoping for a better world, doing something that I ever wanted. When you talk about the rap, I never see any opponent, because I believe when I'm looking at the mirror, all I see is a pity me politically violent. So it's safer how you depreciate the money from the town. Many misunderstand when you decide to be silent, but it's so part of the game, and what money keep on balance. So where the hell will I stop when I'm a beast of everything now? But it's that. Uh, when you see me just believe it, I can kill it and I put it in the coffin. Other people don't need to do it, but I still am beloved because I know all they be hating, but they're not giving me shit. Ah, be the same guy. I'd win a different suit with the same tie. Looking like a piece of cake, but the price high. I'd want like a piano to chop die. So the chop die. Yeah. We have uh, different cultures, different languages. So in our music, in our hip hop, we tend to, you know, mix, mix up those cultures, those languages inside to make it unique. You know, the different language like English, French, which is our national languages. We have our, our mother tongues, which we're using, you know, our vernaculars, we mix them inside, you know, to give it that African flair, to give it that Cameroonian identity. Cameroon is rich with so many different cultures. And now this, there's a new generation of artists who are, that are aware of that, you know. So they have something new to propose. The next years to come, I think Cameroonian music will take a, a huge place in the world music. When I was coming up, I did not think that way. I just wanted, I just wanted to make it, have money, have cars and things like that. But now I see a bigger picture. It is not all about that. It is about you impacting lives, influencing people, giving people who had lost all faith in humanity, bringing back that faith, you know, making them know, all right, it is possible. We can do this. Let's just come together, we can do this. I know for a fact that I gave a lot of females the courage to try. At first, they all had to lean back and watch me take the backlash, like, hey, she's a hoe, she's... <laughs> She's a thief, she's a criminal, like all of that shit. I really didn't care. And I still stood my ground. And right now, I see some of them coming up. Before this year runs out, we should have a good number of female rappers in Cameroon. That's what I'm aiming at, at least. Bring others up like me that will be able to stand firm and not be scared to do exactly what they feel like they should do, like follow your dreams. Still here, still on the throne. It's quarantine, nobody coming in my zone. 
I'm infected with hip hop. I'm on the road to riches. I ain't taking a piece up. I'm like a fly. I'm always on some hip hop shit. Mouth full with lyrics. I'm always ready to speak. All the drama I bring with this lyrics is still confusing them. Talk to the queen, bow down like you're a Muslim. I change flow like I change clothes without a problem. But you getting old and get no shows. You getting boring. You KO so the game closed. You so annoying. Ranting on Facebook trying to get on my throne. Nah. I am very, very proud to be on a Cameroonian level because I believe, in a way, nobody would understand your situation more than the people you grew up with. You may not, you know, be from the same family, from the same house, but someone from another country would not understand where I come from because they were not there to witness my story. Even if we don't have support from foreign countries, foreign help, whatever, the rich people, the money, the pleasure that we get from doing it, because it's a passion. First, you want to please yourself, put something out there for free. No audience at all, just go to your Facebook and just put it there, maybe SoundCloud. I don't need to wait for people to come in and help me financially before I can tell the world what I have to say. In Cameroon, you should know that fans are, are very committed, you know. They will, they will carry you as long as you show them that you're worth it. Sometimes I'll say some of my fans are still my producers, you know, because so many will come with advices. Hey, I love what you're doing, but please, you might like to try this. And I find it very lovely, you know, because they feel like it's, it's the um, responsibility, like, to make sure you go higher. marching towards the right path. Our music can now compete with the rest of Africa, it can now compete with the rest of the world because our sound has improved, uh, what we say in our music has improved, has been more mature. So yes, my generation marks the birth of a change. We are there, we are ready, we are ready for the world now.